how to update Minecraft Bedrock Edition on PC. So we're going to be going over in this video. Now, by default, Minecraft Bedrock should just open. So when you go into either the Minecraft launcher here and then launch into Bedrock by clicking on the left-hand side, right like so, Minecraft for Windows, Bedrock Edition, right? Click play. It should just update automatically when you play it. Same thing if you decide to launch it directly by going here and, and clicking on Minecraft. It, it should just work. However, if it doesn't, that's where we can have some issues. How do you know what version of Minecraft you're on, by the way? It's in the bottom right. As you can see, V119.1. That's the most recent version of Minecraft Bedrock Edition. However, if yours doesn't update, let's say it said 119 here, it's not updated. First thing first, make sure you're connected to the internet. If you're not connected to the internet, it's not going to be able to update. So make sure that is working up here in the top right. However, you're connected to the internet, everything is working. It should have updated, but it hasn't. Well, first off, let's try the Microsoft Store method. So basically, click the little Windows icon, top left of my screen, bottom of your screen, bottom of your screen on Windows 11. It all works. No matter what version of Windows you're on, type in Microsoft Store. You'll have this app here. Open this app. And then we want to go ahead and update basically everything on our computer, right? It's been a while since I've opened this because uh, I don't really use any apps from the Microsoft Store. But once you're here, what you want to do is in the bottom left, click Library. Then you want to click Get Updates. At that point, it's going to go through everything that's linked to the Microsoft Store and update it, right? It could take a while. I don't know how long it will take. As you can see, for me, the only thing I had was Xbox Game Bar, and it is now updating that. Once that's installed, we're actually going to move on to the second method that you can use to try to update Minecraft Bedrock Edition on PC. And that is using the Xbox app. Before we get into that, though, how about a message from our sponsor, Apex Minecraft Host, and go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to start your very own 24-hour dedicated Bedrock Minecraft server. At Apex, you can start a Bedrock server in just a few clicks. Plus, there's 24 hours, 7-day-a-week support should you have any issues. We love and trust Apex so much that all of our Minecraft servers are hosted on Apex Minecraft Hosting. So go to the first link down below again, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to get a Bedrock server up and running. Thanks to them for sponsoring this video. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and open up the Xbox app. Now, if you don't have the Xbox app, then you can't really update via this method anyway, right? In that case, it should just kind of update when you open up the Minecraft Bedrock Edition. Once you're in here, though, you can go over into My Library and you'll see everything that's installed. See, I don't have really anything installed, which is kind of part of the problem, right? I don't have much of anything. You have over here on the left-hand side as well all of this stuff and... That is noted to be there, but it's not in the library. It's kind of weird. But nevertheless, once you're here, you can come over here to the left-hand side if you have the Minecraft launcher and try to update it there as well. And go into view details. It really and truly, this should just update, but uh, you can click over here, click three dots, click manage. And then finally, if you go into files, I believe you can check for updates. Let me do that one more time because it was kind of overwhelming. From the Game Pass or My Library or wherever it is, you want to go ahead on the left-hand side, hover over the game, click on the three dots, click View Details, click the three dots again, and click Manage. Then click on Files and click Check for Updates in the Xbox app. That's kind of the last case scenario, right? And for me, it's the Minecraft launcher. For you, it might just be called Minecraft or Minecraft Bedrock Edition or Minecraft Windows 10 Edition. It doesn't matter. Just do that same process of clicking over here and clicking on Manage and then clicking Files and Check for Updates. I was updated, right? So I didn't have any of those things, but that's kind of all the different stuff you can do. You can also click verify and repair here. And basically what that's going to do is verify all the files are accurate and then repair those files if they are broken. But that's a last case scenario, right? Mine was fine, as you can see. So it just worked. But that's kind of a last case scenario. I would try every other update method before doing that. At this point though, you should be able to open up Minecraft Bedrock Edition and it should be on the latest version. In this case, 119.1. But it uh, might be different for you. It might be 119.30 or 119.20. It just depends, right? Or it could be 1.20 or 1.21. Who knows? But as you can see, we are up to date. Thanks so much for watching. This video helped out. Let us know in the comments as well as give it a thumbs up. And if there's any other Minecraft Bedrock Edition videos you'd like to see, let us know in that in the comments as well. See you in the next one. Peace.